Right now, an injured DPD officer is celebrating his career with friends and family by his side. Officer John Adsit was severely hurt after a car hit him as he worked on his bicycle back in 2014. He was protecting students who were returning to East High after a protest downtown. The man who hit him was having a seizure. Our Jamie Leary is live at Coors Field right now, where they're having his retirement party right now, and it's, I'm sure, a very bittersweet party, Jamie. That is the key word here today. Officer Adsit right here, just getting ready to cut his cake, surrounded by his family. His story really a miracle. Doctors didn't expect him to survive. He did. They didn't expect him to walk, but he did. And as big of a miracle as he is today, like you said, bittersweet. There's definitely been a grieving process for him. But luckily today, as you can see, he has his entire DPD family, as well as his wife and children, to help him with the transition. I was kind of a late bloomer into the police world so I, it was short, shorter than I wanted and uh, so it's there's been some grief involved in this process but I know that it's God's got it in his hands and 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 I'll be fine my family will be fine and again days like today it's just wonderful to know all the support that that's kind of around me and my family a halo camera caught the entire incident. The black Mercedes struck Edset, who was then drug underneath the car for almost a half block. Since then, he has had 25 surgeries. He's got five more to go, and he's gone through an incredibly long and difficult rehab process, which fortunately is now over for him. His goal, though, was always to get back to the job, but he hasn't been able to work much, still plagued with the pain and other issues from the accident. He has told us countless times that the outpouring of support has helped him immensely in his recovery, and as difficult as today is, he's going to continue helping people, even as a retired officer. He's going to do that through the Adsit Foundation, which would never have existed without this accident. He's incredibly proud of it. It's two years in the making, and it's helping other officers who have been injured as well. So despite not being in the line of duty, he is still helping people every day that he can. His last official day will be on the 20th. Live in for Jamie Leary, CBS 4 News. Yeah, and Officer Adsit there getting a hug from the Chief of Police in Denver. Jamie, thank you very much. Adsit came in to talk with us on CBS 4 this morning, and during our interview, I asked him whether he now wishes he had picked a different career. Does it make you regret your choice of becoming a police officer, the degree of physical injury you had? Oh, that's a great question. But for me, no, I wouldn't change anything. I, I truly believe that God knew this was going to happen a long time ago and, and, and knew that I was going to be able to get through it and hopefully, hopefully support other people uh, down the road that, that may be going through similar situations uh, like this, both physically and mentally. Officer Adsit said he returned to work on limited duty for a short time, but he just felt he wasn't up to it due to his injuries and he had to retire.